ready? What's this from, Otto? What magazine is this? Oh, uh, Savage Tattoo Magazine. Oh, really? Yeah. Speed. Uh, like at 94, maybe. Speed. Otto, can you tell us a little bit about yourself and what brought you here to the, this ink in the valley? Well, I've come up here to sell my carvings and get tattooed. I've been doing it a while. How, how, what, what was your first tattoo? I got that wolf done in 1974. I'm 45 now, so I've been getting tattooed maybe 28, 28 some years. What about, when was the first one on your face? What, what, tell us about how did the face come about? When did that uh, happen? Little John did it, I think it was 96, and then I came here. Right after it was done, like a month before I came to this show, and uh, that was one of the, really the story there. You're from where? North Carolina. And what, uh, now you're uh, your a family man, you've got, you're, you, you got... Yeah, I'm married, got three kids, I kind of uh, drove a Jeep off a cliff back in 93, so trashed my legs, so I started carving to keep it going crazy, and so ended up, you know, I just do the uh, sale to the tattoo people, so uh, it keeps me busy. You had an accident? And yeah, I drove a Jeep off a cliff, uh, almost ripped off my left leg, I don't have no right ankle. I'm supposed to get it cut off in April, so I just kind of got, you know, I've got a lot of chronic pain, uh, toxic situation going on. Well, That's why I carve, keep me. So you, the carving's therapy for you? Yeah. How did that come about? Did you just start like uh... I got sober. <laughs> I was a drunk before I wrecked the Jeep, you know. So then I had to get sober. So I had to do something, keep going crazy, start carving. Then you know. Hey, get a real then I got grateful guys. again, you know what I'm saying? Working on it. Um, but, uh, if, uh, it's enabled me to my carving's enabled me to get tattooed. I get you know, I'm already running out of space. The tattoo, uh, my stuff's in uh, tattoo studios all over the world, and it all come out, you know, it just started with me selling the skull. And, uh, so what, uh, just, which ones, can we just see your, uh, you know, so you, can you turn around and show us the... I got a full back piece, too. I mean, I'm, I'm all done, upper, upper body's all done. <coughs> so you've got a skull and a Confederate flag on the... I well, I mean, I was born in the South. I mean, you know, a lot of people, I think some people don't even know, understand the flag. I mean, they came through the South and wiped everybody out. There was only a bunch of country boys. So, uh, you know, like when our family reunion, they got their death certificates, you know, they showed us. So, I mean, you know, like that. So, why don't we get a shot? Can we just get a close up of your, of the, do you turn around again? How's that? Is that a good? Yeah. Great. I can I can wear it because I'm covered neat, and most people don't freak out about it. I you know, only had a couple. But it kind of uh, like a lady come up to me in the uh, elevator the other day, and she says, "You know, you got a rebel flag on your head." <laughs> but I mean, you know, I flipped her out that much, you know. So yeah, I do. But, uh, Whatever you do, you know, I think if you ain't got but one life to live, might as well do it. You know, it might be too late for a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? I figured I had a lot of people die this year that were friends. You know. Do you want to get a close up? Of, can we just turn around? Oh, there you go, profile. Well, you had it before. Look, look right here, Otto. How's that? Great. All right. Um, over here, real quick, real quick. Um, you got all that bad Yes, of course. I bought two tickets. Yeah, I think I put one out there that everybody would get. Oh, perfect. Yeah. You hurt yourself. Background. Okay. Okay. Can we, can we just get the, can you just uh, tell us? Sure. You, so you guys are friends? Yes, we are. Yeah. For years. He's got, he's got a king collection. <laughs> yes, I do. Yeah. I've got quite a collection of Otto's carvings. I admire Otto. He takes a lot of strength and stamina what he's doing. You know, I mean, because he had a bad accident years ago, and he's actually a miracle that he was even walking, so. 
We've been good friends for a long time. So you're, you're, uh, you're, you're completely out of what? I got bumped. Uh, that's all right. Go ahead. You're, um, you're both covered and completely? Yeah, well, I'm covered. I'm solid, and I got layers and layers of tattoos. I actually probably have more pigment in me than anybody alive because, I mean, everything on my arms is done at least five times, six times. You know, I've got more cover-ups than you can imagine. My back was done solid three times. So, you know, I've been uh, getting tattooed for 22 years, and I never went more than four months without getting tattooed. You know, I've got work from at least 40 or 50 different artists. So, it's nice. It's a great hobby. It's a great life. So, just the same way with everybody in the sideshow. You know what I mean? We're all here to have fun and enjoy our life. That's what it's about. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much. Well, All right, well, it. I've got to uh, go and judge the best of show. You're, you're the judge? Yes. Can you do a 360 for us? Sure. Wait one sec. I'm sorry. Really? Okay, yeah, go ahead. All right. One more? One more 360. All right. Okay. Who's that? Is that to the Frank Zappa. I yeah. <laughs> well, I got a lot of other really great work on my legs. I mean, I'm sure you could film me for a long time, but uh, I really got to get going and uh, judge the best of show. <laughs> Judging the best of show, so I don't know when you're going to actually do oh, the raffle. Do. All you gotta do is write the number uh, down. I'll probably be back, but yeah. I mean, just in case. Push up that wide ass lens over there. Come closer to me. Okay. Just in case you, I don't know when you're actually gonna. Yeah, they don't know about it. He's getting ready to do it, but if, if okay. they got somebody coming up there, then I'll know. All right, well, just like I say, I'm going to be judging the best okay. of the show, so I wouldn't want to not hear my number and then. Yeah, you want to All right. Okay. Excuse me. Going to get you in the leg. I think that we're all fine. Yeah, thank you. What do they want? Why do they want the social security number on there for? Huh? God, I don't know. They ain't give me no money, are they? <laughs> Why do they give me any money? No, you're not gonna get any money. I'm gonna This work.